Hey guys, I'm here. We did it. Two and two. It happened. Yes. It's beautiful. So, what you do when you get to two and two is you press quit and you don't fucking play the two and two match. Because, well, unless you have a quest that's like on the cusp of completion. We do have a quest, but we'd have to win twice. And I, out of like 250 arena rounds or something, I think I've gone one and four like four times or five times. So I'm always going to win twice. So that's no big deal. But, uh... So, for two wins, at two and two, it's it's basically a question of opportunity cost. So, I'm probably going to get 30 or 40 gold from two wins. If I get three wins, I will get 50 or 60 gold. Uh, I'm pretty sure those are the two rewards. <laughs> it might be 60 or 70. But in any case, it's like 20 gold. Uh, if you value your time at all, never play the two and two game, because it's just a waste of fucking time. And the Shadowverse developers are retards for making it that way. But, uh, simple, but, so, let's say you're a person that has no time whatsoever, that doesn't value their time whatsoever, like, uh, like one, well, maybe not the, uh, the GM guys, but any one of these guys at the top of the list are just people that have Ages and ages of time to play Shadowverse nonstop. And I realized last last expansion I did play a lot, to be fair. But I didn't... Uh, well, let's see here. So... Season? Last season? Here we are. Okay, so this guy, 1276. Uh, he started out at, like, A. It took him... Ooh, uh, I think it took him like 700 games to get to Master from A to, or double A. And then he got to Grandmaster like four or 500 games after that. So me, it took, uh, down here, it took me like, uh, 330 or 350 games to get to Master from A1. And it took me 230 to get to Grandmaster. This guy his win rate has got to be like 55%, something like that. So that means he played something like 1,900 games of Shadowverse. Let's say that's 15 minutes a game. Let's whip out the handy-dandy Windows calculator here. Okay, let's say 14 minutes a game. How's that? 26,600 minutes in a month. Uh, I believe... So there's thousand. That's like sixteen hours a day or something. Uh, it's like thirteen or fourteen hours a day. That's how much this dude played. So if you're like this guy and you get that much time, I I played like six hours a day for um uh, for like a week because uh my win rate was like seventy four percent, which is nineteen percent better than fifty five percent. But uh, if you're that guy, and and you just play Shadowverse all day, every day for your entire life, for no apparent reason, what you should do is still hit quit and then start another arena round, if your objective is just to play a lot of arena or whatever. Because you can get more gold from the started new arena run if you go four or five. Your opportunity costs in terms of gold gain per win is much higher. Um... So just don't fucking play the 2 and 2 game. Go fuck yourself, Shadowverse developers. Thank you very much. I'll take my 2, which is probably going to be like 40 gold. 35 gold. It could have been 60. Oh, the agony. I've only got 15,000 gold. That 25 gold would have made all the difference. But the point is, it's not worth your time. And that's just how bad the arena rewards are. Uh, it's not possible to go infinite. <laughs> um, I think the maximum possible win rate right now is something like 72%. Uh, if you're the best player in the world, and uh, you play perfectly. 72% is going to be like 3.5 wins, right? 3.6 wins. Which is just not enough. <laughs> 
to get uh it might be a little bit more than that it might be like 3.8 wins but to to go infinite you have to go like 4.2 wins which is closer to 84 percent win rate um which is you'd think 84 percent would be impossible but in the early days of arena you could play around absolutely every card in the game olivia is the best card in arena you could play around it but you can't play around bahamut you can't play around uh fucking levi you can't play around basically Every every good card printed after the third expansion is completely broken, ridiculously insane power creep. They don't care because they're just going to nerf it anyway, right? But it just killed Arena. Uh, like, this card, it's still broken. They nerfed it, and it's still broken in Arena. Uh, knuckle? <laughs> it's big knuckle. I always think it's bare knuckle. This guy... Four mana, three, four. It's like a cudgel that you don't have to fucking evolve for. That's what it used to be. Now it's five mana. It's a little bit worse. But I bet you it's still better than cudgel. It's still fucking nuts in Arena. Why do you print this shit? You don't need to print a bronze that's completely fucking broken. Maybe make it a legendary or something. I mean, it'd be the most underwhelming legendary ever, but it would still be broken. So a good card that used to used to be around is this guy. This guy was tactical, interesting, not completely broken. Now he's kind of scary, a little bit nuts, maybe one of the best Dragoncraft cards in Arena, but most people suck with Dragoncraft back then. They actually buffed Dragoncraft a little bit. Uh, I, in my opinion, Dragoncraft was the second best class to Sword in uh, Classic and uh, Darkness of All. But I think in terms of win rate, it was like fourth or fifth. But this this was one of the best cards in it. But destroy a damaged enemy follower is a really cool, awesome mechanic. And they just took it out of the game. It doesn't exist anymore. Instead, you just get... Oh, if you're... Well, let me just give you a Priest of the Cudgel for four mana. And you don't even have to evolve it. It just works by default. It seems brilliant, right? Just smart. Smart plays. But anyway, Arena's kind of trash. I'm not, I'm not salty about going to and to. Actually, I wanted to have the discussion. But, yeah. Uh, I might not do another Rune run this expansion. I do still enjoy playing Rune. Rune is cool and fun. But, it, like, the opponent just face rolls shitty cards that are badly designed. I lose. Oh, a tragedy. <laughs> but, thank you very much for watching the video, and I'll see you next time. Um, I think Dragon is the only class that I haven't done. We did forest, we did sword. I have no idea what the symbol is. This must be room. Just did room. Did portal shadow. Did not do blood. Okay, so we have to do blood and dragon. I want to do portal again. I do have another shadow run that I might, may or may not put up. And that should be it until the next expansion. So that's like six or seven more videos or something. Well, two videos each, but you get the idea. But farewell. Uh, I'll probably split this up into two videos, but I'll keep it in the uh, main video as well. And have a nice day. Never play the 2-2 game unless you're one win away from finishing a quest.